For a special edition of Spilling the Tea, Hey Pearl Tea Room, they are known for the best tea service around town, and they're more than happy to always accommodate your party for an authentic tea service. Yeah. Okay, well, you know what time it is. Let's go spill some tea. from the Cape Pearl Tea Room. Hey, Becky. Hey. Welcome to the show today. Thank you. Okay, so I'm excited I'm in this tea room with you. Tell me about this tea house. We are serving English afternoon tea here. So, you know, it has the three-tiered tray. It has soup, sandwiches, salads, little desserts. Our scones are amazing. Ooh. We have sorbet. We have sparkling drinks. And we have tea. Do people love this place? Like, I just feel like a different atmosphere when I come here. I feel comfortable. But, you know, I'm a tea spilling princess, so obviously I'm going to feel comfortable here. Uh, what's the atmosphere like when you guys um, are up and running? It's humming. It's buzzing. It's mm -hmm. a great place to really connect with someone. You can sit down and spend two hours really connecting over a pot of tea and some yummy treats. And people, people love the tea room. What is the proper way to sip tea or drink tea? So, um, I don't know that there's necessarily a right way and a wrong way. Okay. We want you to be comfortable. Did you know that it is actually improper etiquette to stick your pinky out when you're <gasps> holding a teacup? Oh my gosh. I can't help it though. I stick my pinky out for every little thing that I do. Look, it just automatically goes up. <laughs> I didn't even do it, y'all. I'm not even doing it and it just keeps going up. It's, oh my God. So it's actually like improper to do that. Actually it is. You're also not supposed to tink your spoon on in the in the inside of the teacup. Oh my god, we've been drinking tea wrong, y'all. You usually pour about half a cup of tea because some people like to put cream and sugar in. Oh, you didn't even spill it. No. She didn't spill the tea. <laughs> and you can't have tea without scones. Oh, obviously. There's all different kinds of tea. They actually all get different steep times and mm -hmm. different water temperatures. Oh, okay. Here's wow. a little secret for you. If you're mm -hmm. steeping a black tea and you walk away to do your hair or whatever it is you're doing, <laughs> yes. and you come back and your cup is bitter, mm -hmm. you can fix the cup. You don't have to throw it out. You don't have to throw it out? No, 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 no. no. You put it in the microwave. You dilute it. You oh, you dilute more it. Hot water, <laughs> okay. More hot water, and that'll okay. dilute the tannins, which is what okay. makes it bitter. Okay, Becky, now tell everybody how how they can follow you and reach you guys. Okay, our Instagram is Kate Pearl Tea Room and our website is thekatepearltearoom.com. If you'd like to come in for tea, it's by reservation only. Oh wait, what happens when you spill the tea? What happens when tea is spilled? Um, Do you have bad luck? No. Okay, good, that no. was scary. Ooh, okay. We love spilling the tea. Yay, we love spilling the tea. Thank you guys for joining us today. Now go sip on all that tea. <laughs> Still ahead, the Boston Marathon is underway, coming up the history of running 